All right, here is my tip of the week. Go out and buy a case or as many cases as possible of this Wild Turkey 101 rye before Campari realizes it's not supposed to be in the mid 20s, but it's gonna be $50 a bottle because of how good it is, how under the radar the quality is. Um, to me, the spice level of this 101 rye Wild Turkey has grown tremendously in years. Um, it literally competes now with the Sazeracs and the 95.5 MGP Rise of the World. It's under 30 bucks and it's always available. So like I said, to me, this is like a classic. You gotta taste it to understand and to know that the quality level is up here where the price and availability are still down here. And at some point they're gonna meet up, but uh, they haven't yet. So this is the opportunity to go in and get it. Rock hard diamond rye on the nose, absolutely perfect. Soft fruit, little bit of spice, but that rye note is fantastic. Mm. On the palate, the rye emerges immediately. It's piney, it's fresh, it's zesty. Um, just want another sip, but it's got this background sweet note to it as well, and this background char note that balances that, that out. But the rye is just apparent, it's immediate, and it's really a beautiful whiskey. I'm so glad we've got it.